Come and get to know more information about the unique state of Melaka in Melaka is my destination. You have the opportunity to visit and learn more about the culture, about the most historical town in Malaysia and discover new places in Melaka. The people, the distinctive foods and the latest activities that you could join us in MIND. Melaka is my destination. Airing live every Monday starting 9.15 till 10 p.m. at Melaka FM 102.3 Mempersonakan. It is 9.15pm uh, for tonight uh, How do you do? Assalamualaikum Salam sejahtera Salam sati sejiwa uh, For you guys who are li- listening right now at 102.3 and through MelakaFM.rtm.gov.my It's me Daim Zainuddin For 3 hours Starting right now in Persona 9 till 12 But for this moment until 10pm We are going to be in the Melakis My Destination And with me right now I'm not alone uh, I'm not alone Don't you worry I'm with Mr. Jerry From Makota Medical Centre In Marques My Destination How do you do? Hi, good evening Good evening What about you? Fine, thank you But yeah but Because of the haze It's a bit tough <laughs> Yeah Because we Yeah So drink lots of water mm-hmm. Have enough rest yeah, so and you should be okay. Ah, uh, have enough rest, drink a lot of plenty of water. Yeah. Okay. Uh, maybe for for me and for our listeners, uh, which is in Malacca, in uh, uh, Negeri Sembilan, and a part of it in Johor, and mostly in Riau, Bengkalis, Indonesia. Uh, when is it that the Makota Medical Center is established, and where is it located? Right. Mm-hmm. So first of all, thank you so much, uh, Malacca okay. FM, for having me. Uh, mm-hmm. For having Mal- Makota Medical Center to be here with you, we are mm-hmm. really glad that you have uh, welcomed us. Mm-hmm. So Makota was established in mm-hmm. the year 1994, oh, okay. and uh, since then it has grown to become a leading provider mm-hmm. in terms of healthcare mm-hmm. in Malacca. Mm-hmm. So Malacca is such a historical city. It's, it's true. not just uh, people coming forth. Um, tourism Mm -hmm. but medical tourism as well so Makota being in a very strategic uh, located in a very strategic place Mm -hmm. uh, area it's in the heart of town Malacca town itself Mm -hmm. so there are plenty of food uh, patients can go around after Mm -hmm. they have recovered Mm -hmm. so it's uh, the hospital is truly in a very uh, strategic area in 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 Malacca town itself Mm -hmm. especially in the new aspect of uh, medical tourism truly Mm-hmm. Yes, uh, in fact, um, medical tourism is such a huge thing right now in this mm-hmm. region and mm-hmm. particularly in our country. Mm-hmm. Um, in, in, in Makota Medical Center, we have uh, rep offices mm-hmm. um, in Indonesia. Oh. We have 15 rep. 15? Yes. Uh, in we Indonesia? Have, oh. That's right. We have 15 rep offices in Indonesia mm-hmm. and uh, one in Cambodia. Mm-hmm. Um, in Phnom Penh in Cambodia mm-hmm. uh, we have an agent in uh, Myanmar mm-hmm. um, and even in, uh, in Malaysia we have a rep office as well in Batu Pahat mm-hmm. so these these are offices mm-hmm. and that will they, they facilitate on um, when, when some uh, walk in uh, uh, potential patients Patient when they walk in mm-hmm. um, they would get gather information and uh, we will oh. be able to help them on logistics if needed or uh, in terms of recommendation of uh, the specialist so there's no problem at all for our neighboring countries uh, tourists or patients that would like to come by to Makota to get uh, a more uh, sophisticated uh, medical uh, support is it yeah. Mm-hmm. So logistically, uh, Malacca, we have we have an airport right now. We yeah. have an uh, international airport. Mm-hmm. Uh, we receive patients from Pekanbaru. Pekanbaru. Mm-hmm. Um, even from the jetty. Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. From Dumai. Dumai. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And uh, if they travel from other areas of Indonesia or uh, different parts of the region, mm-hmm. they can fly into KLIA and just take a bus. Mm-hmm. Uh, just about two hours, and they will be at the hospital uh, for treatment. All the best with the to Medical Center. Thank you. <laughs> okay, uh, maybe how many patients uh, does uh, the, the Makota Medical Center receive and mostly where do they come from? Mm-hmm. Uh, Makota Medical Center, we receive almost about uh, 290,000 patients annually. Mm-hmm. And um, of course, uh, the demographics, it's uh, Malaysian, uh, local patients are still... Um, 
the most. Mm -hmm, the biggest um, in numbers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, biggest in numbers. Mm -hmm. And uh, a quarter of these patients are from neighboring countries as well, mm -hmm. uh, particularly from Indonesia and Singapore. Oh, even Singapore, they do come uh, to come by to to get. Yeah, that's right. Uh, mm -hmm. in, in Malaysia, mm -hmm. it's not very far away, um, mm -hmm. and it, it's cost effective. And yeah. again, I said uh, they don't sometimes they don't just come here for medical treatment. Yeah. Uh, but they come here to have to enjoy the food mm -hmm. and uh, to visit places. The historical places. Yeah. Just by Makota Medical Center, right? That's yeah. right. So mm -hmm. Malacca basically has nearly everything. You want shopping, you want food and of course uh, most important we are here to provide uh, quality uh, health care to our patients. The best health care to the patients that That's come right. by. Wow. With Makota Medical Center. Okay Jerry, we are going to be taking uh, a short break for now and uh, for those of you who are listening right now, you want the best of medical attention, please do come by to Makota Medical Center and if you want, don't want to see doctor, you can see Mr. Jerry over here. <laughs> Alright, with Shaggy and Mahombi, with I need your love, you need attention, you need a lot of medical attention, uh, please do come to Makota Medical Center. I need your love. Very amazing, yeah. Like a fam. This is Jay with Flashlight uh, right here on 102.3 Radio Malaysia Malaka FM, the number one radio in Malaka. And how do you do for tonight? Uh, hopefully, that unite is uh, as hot as I am because uh, even though that I'm hot, Mr. Jerry is going to cool me off right now We're from Makota Medical Center. And uh, we have talked about uh, when was the hospital was established and does Makota Medical Center uh, provide any specialist care uh, for patients of different needs maybe? Mm -hmm. Yes, that's right. Um, in up to 2012, um, mm -hmm. we have what we call the COE, which is the Center of Excellence. We mm -hmm. had we used to have seven center of excellence. Mm -hmm. uh, they were created, which are woman and child, mm -hmm. men's health, mm -hmm. wellness, heart, mm -hmm. bone and joint replacement, Ooh. cancer center, mm -hmm. neurological and stroke center. Mm -hmm. And so these are the seven centers um, that we have up to 2012. Mm -hmm. And most recently this year, we had uh, three more mm -hmm. centers of excellences. Mm -hmm. Uh, three, sorry, three set more centers of excellence mm -hmm. uh, that were added, and it's the diabet diabetic center, mm -hmm. emergency and trauma center, mm -hmm. li and liver and gastro center. Oh, so which means that uh, Malaysians uh, who, who has any kinds of problems that related to these uh, seven uh, special needs, they just come on over to Makota Medical Center and no need to go to KL maybe. Yes, that's right. Uh, Makuta Medical Center, it's a tertiary hospital. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, it's one-stop um, solution. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, the patient can get diagnosed. Mm -hmm. uh, if, a, if they have a problem, they can come and get diagnosed. They mm -hmm. can get themselves uh, treated. Mm -hmm. And of course, uh, the post-treatment rehabilitation comes into picture. Mm -hmm. So, and... Uh, whatever procedures that needs to be done, it's mm -hmm. all done in Makuta Medical Center in the hospital itself. Under one roof, is it? It's under one one roof. That's mm -hmm. why I said uh, it's uh, like one stop. It's a one stop solution. Mm -hmm. So it is a a very comprehensive. We have um, facilities and services are all designed um, mm -hmm. so that uh, patients can be treated and can be diagnosed and uh, all done in the under one roof in the hospital. Under one yeah. roof, special one. <laughs> okay, uh, I've heard that uh, there are unique uh, medical uh, sub-specialties available at Makota and could you elaborate more on that, uh, Mr. Jerry? Mm. We have some sub-specialties which mm. are generally not available in most private hospitals. Mm -hmm. uh, in southern, especially in southern peninsula Malaysia, mm -hmm. uh, these include breast surgery, oh, okay. mm -hmm. endocrinology, mm -hmm. geriatrics, mm -hmm. gynecology, gyne and oncology, mm -hmm. hematology, mm -hmm. reproductive medicine, shoulder and spine surgery, and vascular interventional radiology. Mm -hmm. So recently we have also introduced a few more subspecialties such as pediatric cardiology oh, pediatric for children, okay. children mm -hmm. with heart problems, mm -hmm. hepatopancreatic biliary surgery, mm -hmm. uh, got to do with the liver, pancreas, mm -hmm. respiratory medicine, respiratory, okay. respiratory mm -hmm. the lungs, yep. special, mm -hmm. uh, emergency medicine, mm -hmm. Vitro retinal surgery, oh, the eye. The eye. Okay. That's right. Mm -hmm. 
all these have helped us to provide more comprehensive clinical offerings to our patients. Mm -hmm. So, which means that more patients can get right before this uh, under one roof and specialty needs they could get it yes mm -hmm. so it's uh now uh, the trend it's it's just not just um general mm -hmm. uh, people are very the specialists um, they are very focused mm -hmm. uh, so that's why we call it the sub specialty mm -hmm. not just specialists but mm -hmm. very mo much more detail mm -hmm. uh, the sub specialty and they are very much focused uh, to 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 a problem uh, to an issue the patient is facing and we will the doctors will address it and will treat it accordingly mm -hmm. so yeah so it's very focused that's why we call it the sub specialty sub specialties that's work. right you guys you girls <laughs> everyone you have heard that uh, specialties sub specialties and there's a lot more of uh, special needs that uh, the Makota Medical Center can cater by just do come by to Makota Medical Center in Maka is my destination okay Jerry we are going to be taking another short break if not Mr. Jerry, Mr. Jerry will run away from me alright with Kelly Clarkson heartbeat, heartbeat songs uh, if your heart has something to do uh, uh, yo, something wrong uh, you can go to Makota Medical Center uh. everything is going to be done right over there the best of the best Radio Malaysia Melaka FM Our <laughs> city featuring Adam Levine with luck away in Radio Malaysia Melaka FM Luck is my destination with me Daim Zainuddin and Mr. Jerry from Makota Medical Center you have heard about uh, the uniqueness of uh, Makota Medical Center uh, the special uh, specialties or the care the needs that you need you can come by to Makota Medical Center but to elaborate more Mr. Jerry Mr. Jerry maybe uh, about the Makota Diabetes Center and uh, I would like to ask this you have annually 290,000 plus, right, patients. But how many doctors do you have to attend uh, the needs of these uh, clients, these patients? Right. So as of currently, mm -hmm. uh, to date, we have about we have eight um, we have 86 um, consultants mm -hmm. um, and of course uh, medical officers as well. Mm -hmm. So our hospitals is just not just. Um, we have a dental center as well. Oh, okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. that that will take care of our oral health. Mm -hmm. uh, besides uh, the normal, the usual uh, uh, medical, general medical um, disciplines. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we have dental as well. Mm -hmm. So in total, we have eighty six doctors. Eighty six doctors and consultants, and the specialties. But Makota Diabetes Center. You'd like to elaborate more on that? Yes, uh, mm -hmm. we have recently um, launched. Um, our one, our latest COE Center mm -hmm. of Excellence. Mm -hmm. It's Makota Diabetes Center. Yeah. Um, in Malaysia, we see an upward trend in patients, um, a diabetes patient, and yeah. it's a problem in our country. Mm -hmm. So what we did was um, we set up a, a Center of Excellence, yeah. very mm -hmm. very much focused uh, dealing with uh, diabetes. Mm -hmm. So. Um, what it happens it's uh, we have a, a package a makota diabetic package mm -hmm. um, the doctors uh, the nurses mm -hmm. uh, team have came up with this package and um, it is very focused in uh, managing helping patient to manage this uh, disease mm -hmm. so uh, this makota diabetic package is uh, something launched it's mm -hmm. launched newly launched in maybe in um, beginning of this year yeah mm -hmm. so uh, this package encompasses a very comprehensive um, examination and mm -hmm. test from A to Z right mm -hmm. so when mm -hmm. patient comes they come fasted uh, for eight hours yeah mm -hmm. and then they come in the morning mm -hmm. they get their blood tested yeah mm -hmm. and then after that they will have um, then they, of course they are they can mm -hmm. have their meal because mm -hmm. they have uh, fasted mm -hmm. and then after that they can come for their I check. Oh, right. So check, okay. our mm -hmm. ophthalmologist will mm -hmm. see them mm -hmm. uh, for the eye check, mm -hmm. and then a dietitian will explain and advise them on their diet habit. And uh, we have a diabetes uh, educator, no, oh, okay, as mm -hmm. well who will counsel them. Oh, 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 right. Oh, oh. So it's um, and of course uh, last but not least our physician. Mm -hmm. After all the results have been gathered. Our endocrinologist, uh, they will. Mm -hmm. She she will see and and make sure um, uh, she will set the benchmark, mm -hmm. 
and on how to manage uh, the patient accordingly based on the results and uh, she will recommend. So this is something that is uh, one of the latest... A very uh, comprehensive package. Really. Yes, mm -hmm. because uh, we, we, we don't want patients to, mm -hmm. you know, one mm -hmm. day come for uh, blood and then another month come for eye and, <laughs> and, then, and then do other things. So with this uh, uh, platform mm -hmm. or with this service, uh, the patient can just do everything uh, in a single day mm -hmm. uh, within about four to five hours mm -hmm. and they are good to go you can get, get the test get the result and then uh, counseling right physician oh everything is yes mm -hmm. so with this uh, based on the results mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, they have a full uh, almost a full picture mm -hmm. the condition of the patient and then uh, the endocrinologist will recommend or suggest um, what kind of treatment that is needed for this part, uh, for the particular patient. And what should the patient uh, do afterwards, right? That's okay. right. Um, with this kind of offerings, and uh, I, I believe that many of our listeners uh, is very, very uh, sabar lah. We want to be with Makota Medical Center. And uh, are there any kind of CSR that Makota Medical Center had done? Uh, to to the uh, to our listeners maybe mm -hmm. right just like to share with you uh, mm -hmm. we are celebrating our twenty uh, first anniversary mm -hmm. uh, like I mentioned at the beginning um, it was established in nineteen ninety four yeah mm -hmm. and uh, this year we are celebrating uh, celebrating our twenty first anniversary mm -hmm. so we have come a long way um, since uh, the Makota Medical Center. Um, was established mm -hmm. so we are not just providing health care patients coming in and yeah. we we, um, we help them and we treat them but also the hospital is very much involved in um, corporate social responsibility activities mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and um, this upcoming one it's on the 11th of October we are having a big run mm -hmm. uh, it's called Makota Charity Run mm -hmm. United Against Cancer Ooh, we all know that um, mm -hmm. October, it's pink October. Pink October. So, yeah. um, so in conjunction with uh, the man, uh, the awareness on pink October and cancer in general, mm -hmm. uh, we are having this run. This mm -hmm. is our second run. Oh, we had we had a run last year, mm -hmm. and um, and this year we're going to have w uh, one more on mm -hmm. the 11th of October. Mm -hmm. um, up to date, we have about 1,200 runners that oh. have. Yes, thousand mm -hmm. two. Yeah, that have uh, registered yes, that, mm -hmm. uh, for this run, mm -hmm. and uh, the fund that uh, that is collected from this event uh, will help, and it goes all to uh, to our charity partner mm -hmm. that will assist and will help needy patients, mm -hmm. both adult and children, mm -hmm. uh, patients with who are dealing with cancer. Who yeah. are dealing? Yes, that's mm -hmm. right. Dealing mm -hmm. with cancer, mm -hmm. and this fund is set aside to help them. Or special funds for them, right? That's right. Oh wow. It's, it's for charity. Actually. That's right. It's mm -hmm. just for yeah. It's mm -hmm. totally uh, charity, mm -hmm. and even uh, besides that, the hospital is very much involved in um, mm -hmm. uh, giving health talk. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a team of very experienced uh, doctors that can um, that engage the community to uh, share mm -hmm. on, on on a particular topic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, could be on probably depression mm -hmm. uh, issues that people go through or maybe cancer or mm -hmm. heart diseases mm -hmm. various kind of sicknesses yeah, mm -hmm. um, so we and, and all this is free of charge we do set up a medical booth as well mm -hmm. we provide a free glucose test mm. uh, blood pressure blood. check mm -hmm. um, um, even BMI and dietary mm -hmm. advice so uh, the hospital is truly um, just reaching out to the community we are not just um, just business all not about business, business all no about business. but uh, we want the, the community we want to reach out to the community we want to tell them that it is important to take care of their health mm -hmm. that is what uh, Makota Medical Center is uh, pointing right now but uh, from 1994 until now to the 21st anniversary and maybe that uh, there are any awards or accreditation that has the hospital kind of maybe recently or among the biggest that you can share about mm -hmm. right Makuta was conferred the Malaysian Society for Quality in Health mm -hmm. uh, which is known as MSQH mm -hmm. accreditation for the first time in 2008 mm -hmm. last year we managed to secure the accreditation again for a period of four years mm -hmm. 
This is a testament to the fact that Makuta has achieved substantial compliance mm -hmm. in all call and safety sense standards. Mm -hmm. Also, this year Makuta's laborat laboratory was awarded MSO ISO 15189 mm -hmm. by the Department of Standards Malaysia for the third consecutive time. This is further evidence of our commitment to maintaining high standards. Mm -hmm. We were also the proud recipients of, again, this is this year in 2015, mm -hmm. um, we are the recipients of the prestigious Frost and Sullivan Malaysia Medical Tourism Hospital of the Year Ooh. Award. Okay. Mm -hmm. So this award recognizes major players in the local health industry. Mm -hmm that have contributed towards making Malaysia an international destination for medical tourism. Mm -hmm. And um, additionally, Makota accepted two awards from the, Mala from the Malaysian Healthcare Travel Council, mm -hmm. in short MHTC. And these awards were for the highest number of healthcare travelers. Oh, oh for the medical right. tourism. Eh? That's right. <laughs> highest number of healthcare travelers mm -hmm. and, health and highest revenue for healthcare travelers mm -hmm. so respectively mm -hmm. respectively in this uh, southern region mm -hmm. uh, this was in um, 2012 2012 oh, 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 among the best of the best <laughs> in the southern region is it and then uh, maybe uh, lastly uh, if you would like to reach out to our listeners which is in Melaka in Nagusmilan in Johor and part of them in Indonesia in Bengkali in Pekanbaru in Dumai uh, for the best medical attention with Makota Medical Center please Right, so uh, we uh, first of all, we mm -hmm. just want to say, we want to extend our appreciation. We want to say thank you to to the community, to our patients, to our doctors, mm -hmm. to everyone, to, R, uh, to RTM, yeah. Leka FM, mm -hmm. um, that have been uh, supporting Makota Medical Center. We know that uh, we won't be here um, unless you support us. Yeah. And we are very glad that uh, Makota Medical Center continue to exist and continue to move forward um, in providing better health care, we know uh, health care it's, it's very um, it's at once, it's getting more and more at once yeah, uh, mm -hmm. and um, it, with, with this we are hopeful that even as the community support us and we yeah. will of course do our best mm -hmm. in providing the best health care um, so we, for that we want to say thank you and um, we just want to say that Makota Medical Center it's um, not just um, focus on um, receiving uh, just patients, patients but we yeah. want mm -hmm. to reach out to mm -hmm. uh, to put uh, to the community mm -hmm. um, like for example like health screening mm -hmm. uh, these are for healthy people mm -hmm. and uh, health screening we want to advise that it's very important it's it's you please do your health screening your mm -hmm. yearly health screening mm -hmm. if you are probably 35 years old and above mm -hmm. uh, please have your regular check uh, just come by to Makota Medical Center Health Screening Center is on the fifth floor mm -hmm. and we will be glad to help you so thank you so much uh, for having me today uh, for having me tonight mm -hmm. and of course we look forward to many more years in providing good and quality health care for Malacca, mm -hmm. for the country, and of course for the region. Mm -hmm. For may maybe the, the the listeners want to reach out. How, how is it? Right. Mm -hmm. uh, so we can uh, we can be contacted um, via. Uh, you can like us on Facebook mm -hmm. if you want to know more updates about the hospital, mm -hmm. tips on maintaining your health. Uh, please like us on Facebook. Um, you can watch us on YouTube. Just key in Makota Medical Center, mm -hmm. and then uh, you will have all information. Our website, as well, Makota Medical Center, um, and you can get mm -hmm. all the information that you need. But if if not, then just give us a call zero six two eight five. Two triple nine. Two triple nine. That's right. Uh, for the best medical attention and the best health care, no matter where you are right now, uh, maybe in Indonesia, in Negeri Milan, in Melaka itself, and in Johor, you can please do come by to Makota Medical Center. Thank you, Mr. Jerry. Maybe uh, there is going to be another time we are going to be together in Melaka's medicine nation. Maybe. Yes, uh, <laughs> I'm sure this is not going to be the first time. So tune in. Uh, we have a great 
uh, DJ here. Um, yeah, and uh, definitely Makutra Medical Center will be glad to come and share more. Right. Thank you, Mr. Jerry. Okay, and there you are from uh, Makutra Medical Center, Mr. Jerry Sito. Um, the best healthcare, the best of the best uh, in the southern region and maybe in Malaysia. Ah, you want to get a better healthcare? Please do come by to Market Medical Center, just like Mr. Jerry uh, said just now, uh, through the through YouTube, to uh, Facebook, uh, through the Market Medical uh, dot com, you can get it, everything, in there, all the information, right here, in Market FM. Market is my destination. See you again with Khalifa, with Charlie friends in Market FM.